Duke defeated Indiana 94 74 here Wednesday night. The Big Ten ACC Challenge. I really thought 15 is here all time. This is Matt Ryan. I really did it uh, with a lot of Brandon Ingram, the star of this game, came out and five on fire. He shot eight, seven of his eight shots, four three pointers. It really helped stay huge in the game. He absolutely did. He had eight points right out of the game before the first TV timeout. A couple of threes and a long two. So right from the game, you can tell it's going to be a special night for Brandon Ingram. He had 24 half points, another four after half point, 24 uh, career high for him. You can really finally tell that talent is playing up to the expectations that he had coming into Durham as the number three overall recruit last year. Uh, but Ryan, he certainly wasn't the only one that had big night for him. Matt Jones also had a career high. Uh, Jones poured in five three pointers, and 11 of them, a little higher shot volume. To see, but both came to conference that John Shire was telling Jones to shoot, and Jones did, and he was knocking down at a high rate. So, new career high for Matt Jones 23 points uh, from Virginia Texas. He really helps uh, the most cool play in the second half. Indiana, after he had a good fast start, Indiana fought back to the street, took a lead in the movement, caused him that. Finally, did think they got the three and got that with a 10 0 run, and they really came out with, like the fourth game in a row, but they, they blitzed the pitchers to come back to the locker room and start the game. They absolutely did. It was all the way until I believe the 11:30 mark, more than seven minutes into the half. The Indiana actually oh, scored a lot of field goal. They had a couple of free throws to that point. But really, the middle of the defense timing them. Uh, talking about it in the press conference, Coach Case worked up their zone a little bit, coming out of uh, halftime. He adjusted to the two three a little bit. Some of the veteran guys in the lineup, uh, but mainly man for the Blue Devil defense. They were really just able to lock up on the Indiana players. Uh, Yogi Ferrell had some success, but really wasn't able to distribute as well as he'd like. So credit to Matt Jones and the rest of the Blue Devil defenders for being able to lock them down. Really Really a talented offensive Indiana team, uh, and Duke just kind of shut them down for a big period. One of the guys who was by the way, just the ability to get past the old star from the river. It seemed like whenever they wanted to get to the rim, the Bulls were able to, whether it was Grayson Allen, Matt Jones, Derek Miller, they're all able to kind of drive the lane uh, really at will, and that's what the Indiana coach Tom Creek pointed to the first press conference and said, This is what you have to get better at because they can drive the lane and finish at the rim, but they kick out the threes. Uh, Duke knocked down 11 three pointers tonight. He's, we're going to win a lot of games today. 11 3 points, 20 94 points. So that's the post game wrap here at Cameron North. Duke 94, Indiana 74. A little victorious. Big 10 ACC Challenge. I'm Ryan Ritter. We'll see you guys.